is Tamara Weeks with Tam's Daily Vlog. Today is Tam Talk and I get to talk about anything I want to. So I want to talk to you about going to the dentist and how do I relax. When I was younger, relaxing at the dentist was never a problem that I remember. But as I've gotten older, it is becoming more of a problem to just sit in that chair and let them clean my teeth or do some kind of dental work. I've only had one experience in my entire life at the dentist and it wasn't the dentist's fault. I was in my 40s and I had a root canal done and for the first time ever it felt like I was going to have a panic attack the entire time that I am there and I don't know those, those things seem like they take forever but I remember I just wanted to bolt off the chair and run out of the dentist office and I never wanted to go back again. But while I was in this table, I was concentrating, not on the table, but in the, in the dentist chair, I was concentrating on breathing and I was also thinking about a trip that I made to Florida five, six years ago on the beach. I was thinking about the sand, thinking about the water, thinking about the waves and the sun that was coming down and just thinking about that one little experience that I had right there on the beach and I pretended like I was there reliving it or I was there right then instead of in that dentist chair. I don't do that a whole lot where I transport my mind somewhere else to get my mind off of something. It's just not the way my mind usually thinks. But I was desperate that day that I was on that dentist chair and I knew that I had to stay there until he was done. My mouth is on the small side, so they have to prop it open with one of those jaw things. And he had one of those big things across my, my mouth. I don't remember now exactly what it was, but it was like a mask that he had that was covering my, covering my nose and my mouth. Seemed like it was covering my nose and my mouth. Anyway, I felt like I was sort of... Um, suffocating maybe that's what it was it was whatever he had had on my face that was just it was horrible um, but I was able to get through that and then I think it was after that that they started giving me gas when they would do procedures and I've now I've been able to do procedures now that they've done in my mouth and not needed the gas but that is an option that I have I had them even write that in my chart so that I could get through a visit it just relaxed me long enough for me to get through my dental visit and then as soon as the dental visit is over then the effects of the gas go away. Today I have a pretty big headache and I wanted to cancel my dentist appointment this morning but I knew it was only for an hour. It was at nine o'clock. I got up really early this morning and even though I had a headache I was dusting and cleaning and straightening things up and I was thinking about whether I was going to cancel this visit or not. And I'm like, no, 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 I just want to go and get it out of the way. So they were very kind and they put an ice pack on my forehead. I could barely feel it, but it was just enough that it was kind of a distraction. And I was able to, and they just cleaned my teeth. It wasn't, wasn't any big procedure that I had done. But I was able to get through my visit. And so that was nice. And there's somebody walking across the street with a weed eater in their hand. I think they're gonna weed eat, weed eat in the, um, in the weed eat the lawn across the, across the street. So, um, so on a regular visit like today, how do I relax? I concentrate on breathing, and then I will notice that you know there's a body part, you know, my leg or my shoulders or my arms. You know, I'll notice that they are getting tense and so I, I try to concentrate on relaxing you know that part of my body relaxing all over and continuing to breathe and then you know I won't be breathing because I am listening to what the technician is saying or she's talking to me and then I'll notice that you know something is tensed up and so then I concentrate on breathing again so I do a lot of breathing when I go to the dentist, which breathing is good for you, but that's how I relax and get through my dental visits. So I thought I would share that with you. And do you like my hairdo today? This was the dentist visit hairdo. Yesterday I had this part right here where it was, it's, it's a circle, one of those little rosette circle things that I'm not very good at, but they are, they're really pretty when you know how to do them. And then I had to fix, I haven't even looked at the back of my hair because it wasn't the issue. I had to be able to lay down and I didn't wear my hair down today. 
Usually when I go to the dentist, I wear my hair down and then I can just take the barrette out and then my head is flat down. But I just fixed it up super, super high and then it ended up being where I took the end and I made a another rose like there, but my, my hair looks kind of funny today. This is the back. But it was way up on my head so that I could I could lay my hair flat. So this is this is the dentist di dentist visit hairdo today, and I'm not gonna be going anywhere else. Um, my speech has been a little slow for a couple of days from my head. My body has been moving a little slower. A couple of days ago, I worked really hard around the house. And sometimes I can work really hard and I'm okay. And sometimes I work really hard and I'm just not okay for a few days or sometimes a really long time. But I'm my body is moving slower and I'm talking slower. I must have some extra adrenaline right now. I'm not talking as slow right now. You may not be able to tell I'm talking a little bit slower. And my face seems kind of um I don't I don't have the um animation in my face I don't know if that's the right word there's no energy in my face I'm really really tired and my head really hurts and I try to avoid doing videos when I feel like this because I don't feel like my energy is very good to project on on a video but I wanted to tell you about the dentist today and then tell you about um, this is how I sound a little bit of how I sound when headaches make my speech just a little bit slower just takes a little bit longer for me to get words out and I don't have as much expression in my face when my head hurts really bad and when my energy level is really low so this is what's happening today but that's how I get through a dentist visit is I breathe a lot. I concentrate on relaxing my body parts. You know, my, my, it's a little bit harder to relax your face, but you know, relaxing my shoulders, my arms, my hands, my legs, my feet, just relaxing my body and concentrating on breathing so that the breathing helps me relax. So that is how I get through dentist visits. And today I got one, got through a dentist visit with an ice pack on my forehead. So I am doing well. My head hurts really bad and I'm probably done for the day. But all is well. And I will talk to you very soon. Thank you so much for being here and for watching and commenting. I love our conversation that we have and I love being friends with you. We're not real friends. We're virtual friends. And I love virtual friendships, so thank you so much if you are a virtual friend of mine. I will look to the hills from whence cometh my help, for my help cometh from the Lord. I will talk to you very soon. You have yourself a beautiful, beautiful day. Bye-bye.